Have you ever wondered where our galaxy fits within the vast cosmic web? Recent discoveries suggest that the Milky Way might be part of an even larger structure than previously thought, a finding that could reshape our understanding of the universe. Research now indicates our galaxy may reside in a massive basin of attraction, potentially far more extensive than the Laniaki supercluster. This basin, possibly including the Shapley supercluster, raises critical questions about the scale of cosmic structures and how gravity governs galactic motion. In this exploration, we will delve into why this discovery is so important, how it challenges current models, and what it means for the future of cosmology. At the heart of this discovery is the concept of a basin of attraction, a region of space where galaxies move toward common points due to gravitational forces. Much like water flows toward rivers in a watershed, galaxies flow through these basins toward clusters and superclusters, pulled by gravity. This is a vital part of the cosmic web, a massive interconnected structure of galaxies, dark matter, and gas that spans the universe. For years, we believed the Milky Way was part of the Lanyaki supercluster, a colossal structure spanning 500 million light years. However, recent research by the Cosmic Flows team, led by astronomer Brent Tully, revealed something extraordinary. The Milky Way might belong to an even larger basin of attraction. According to data from the Cosmic Flows Force survey, which mapped the movement of 56,000 galaxies. This new basin, potentially centered around the Shapley supercluster, could be 10 times the volume of Laniaki. The gravitational tug of war between different basins makes this discovery even more intriguing. The Shapley concentration, for example, lies in the direction toward which the Milky Way and its neighboring galaxies are moving. This suggests that Shapley's immense mass exerts a significant gravitational pull on our galaxy, which could be why we're drifting toward it. Mapping these movements is crucial because it helps scientists understand the large-scale distribution of matter in the universe, including elusive dark matter, which doesn't emit light, but still affects galaxy motion. Researchers from institutions such as the University of Hawaii, AIP Potsdam, and Hebrew University used advanced redshift surveys and sophisticated data analysis to map the local universe in greater detail than ever before. These surveys measure the velocity and motion of galaxies, allowing scientists to track how gravitational forces act on them. Specifically, the Cosmic Flows 4 CF4, dataset played a crucial role in reconstructing the gravitational landscape of our local universe. This dataset enabled researchers to create probabilistic maps of basins of attraction, regions where gravity dominates and directs the movement of galaxies. By studying galaxy velocities over time, the team could determine the specific basins galaxies are moving toward and the structures that influence them. One of the most striking revelations from this research is the identification of the Sloan Great Wall, one of the most significant known cosmic structures, stretching across half a billion cubic light years. This discovery pushes the boundaries of our understanding of celestial formations and raises new questions about mass distribution in the universe. Mapping these vast regions, however, is more complex. Visible light alone is not enough. Scientists must also account for dark matter, the invisible substance that constitutes around 85% of the universe's mass. While dark matter doesn't emit or reflect light, its gravitational influence on galaxies is significant. By analyzing how galaxies move, researchers can infer the presence of dark matter and its role in shaping these immense structures. Despite these advancements, Current observational tools have limitations, and mapping such vast cosmic regions involves some uncertainty. As Evan Nakar, one of the lead researchers, noted, We are still gazing through giant eyes, but even these eyes may not be big enough to capture the full picture of our universe. This means that while the data suggests an even larger cosmic structure than we previously imagined, further observations are required to confirm this vast system's full extent and implications. The implications for cosmological models are profound. As we uncover the full extent of these massive basins of attraction, particularly the Shapley supercluster, one of the central models in modern cosmology, the Lambda Cold Dark Matter LCDM model, faces new challenges. The LCDM model has guided our understanding of how galaxies, superclusters, and other cosmic structures form and grow since the Big Bang. This model suggests that cosmic structures can only grow to a specific size due to the universe's expansion. Like the Shapley supercluster challenged these assumptions, suggesting that some cosmic structures may be far larger than previously thought. A key element in understanding these giant structures is dark matter. While invisible dark matter exerts a gravitational force that shapes the universe's large-scale structure, 
The discovery of a massive basin of attraction like the Shapley Supercluster highlights the significant role that dark matter plays in holding these structures together. Without dark matter's gravitational pull, such vast systems could not exist as they do today. These basins raise fundamental questions about the distribution of dark matter. Current models may need revision to explain how dark matter interacts with ordinary matter and cosmic expansion. The existence of larger basins implies that dark matter's distribution might be more diffuse than previously thought, or that its gravitational influence operates in ways we do not fully understand. In this context, the cosmic web theory becomes essential to understanding how galaxies are connected on such massive scales. According to the cosmic web theory, galaxies do not exist in isolation but form a vast interconnected network. This network is composed of filaments of dark matter, the mysterious and invisible substance that exerts a gravitational pull, influencing the distribution and movement of galaxies. These dark matter filaments act like cosmic highways, along which galaxies travel and gather, eventually clustering at intersections known as nodes. These nodes can be massive, forming superclusters of galaxies like the Shapley Supercluster. The Shapley Supercluster, one of the largest known structures in the universe, exemplifies this concept. It is a dense region where numerous galaxies are gravitationally bound, illustrating the intricate connections predicted by the cosmic web theory. The identification of such large basins of attraction within the cosmic web supports the idea that galaxies are not randomly distributed but are part of a larger organized structure influenced significantly by dark matter. This discovery significantly impacts cosmological research, offering new directions for exploration. For instance, understanding the nature and behavior of these dark matter filaments and nodes can provide deeper insights into the fundamental forces shaping the universe. Researchers can investigate how these massive structures form, evolve, and interact over time, potentially revealing new physics beyond our current models. One of the most promising techniques for furthering this research is gravitational lensing. This phenomenon occurs when light from distant galaxies is bent around massive objects, such as clusters of galaxies, due to their immense gravitational fields. By studying the distortions in the light, scientists can map the distribution of both visible and dark matter. This method allows researchers to probe the structure of the cosmic web in unprecedented detail, uncovering the hidden scaffolding of the universe. Sophisticated simulations play a crucial role in this endeavor. By integrating observational data from gravitational lensing and other surveys, scientists can create detailed models of the universe's structure. These simulations help to visualize how dark matter filaments connect galaxies and how these connections evolve over billions of years. They also allow researchers to test various hypotheses about the nature of dark matter and its interaction with normal matter. Refining our models of the universe's structure through these advanced techniques can lead to significant breakthroughs in our understanding of cosmic evolution. For example, these studies might reveal how large-scale structures influence galaxy formation and behavior, shedding light on the processes that lead to the diverse range of galaxies observed today. Additionally, understanding the role of dark matter in these structures could provide critical clues to its elusive nature, which remains one of the biggest mysteries in modern physics. The implications of these discoveries extend beyond theoretical research. They have the potential to inform our understanding of fundamental cosmological principles, such as the expansion of the universe and the distribution of matter. This knowledge can also impact other areas of physics, offering new perspectives on the forces and particles that constitute our universe. The discovery that the Milky Way might be part of an even larger basin of attraction than the Laniaki supercluster is a groundbreaking development in cosmology. It challenges our current understanding of the universe's structure and the role of gravity and dark matter. As researchers continue to map the local universe and uncover the complexities of these vast cosmic regions, we can expect this significant advancements in reshapes our perspective the on the Milky Way's place in the universe, but also opens up exciting new avenues for future research. Stay curious, and until next time, keep looking up.